Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. Two people are cooking in a kitchen. B. Several workers are fixing a road. C. A group of people is walking through a park. D. Two people are discussing a presentation in an office. The correct answer is D. Two people are discussing a presentation in an office. Number 2. A. A waiter is serving food to a table. B. A group of chefs is preparing food in the kitchen. C. A couple is dining at a restaurant while looking at an electronic menu. D. People are waiting in line to order food. The correct answer is C. A couple is dining at a restaurant while looking at an electronic menu. Number 3. A. A flight attendant is assisting passengers at the gate. B. A man is talking on the phone at an airport terminal. C. People are walking through a shopping mall. D. A group of passengers is waiting to board a plane. The correct answer is B. A man is talking on the phone at an airport terminal. Number 4. A. A group of people is having a meeting in an office. B. A man is sitting at a restaurant table using a tablet. C. A woman is jogging in a park. D. Several people are working in a construction site. The correct answer is B. A man is sitting at a restaurant table. Number 5. A. A man is reading a book in the park. B. People are playing football in a stadium. C. Two men are fixing a car engine. D. A woman is looking at her phone while shopping. The correct answer is D. A woman is looking at her phone while shopping. Number 6. A. A woman is using her phone in a park. B. A group of children is playing on the swings. C. People are exercising in a gym. D. A family is having dinner. The correct answer is A. A woman is using her phone in a park. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. How did the interview go? A. Yes, I have a follow-up interview. B. It went really well. C. I'm planning to watch a movie. The correct answer is B. It went really well. Number 2. Can you help me with this presentation? A. Let's meet at 3 p.m. B. I have another meeting to attend. C. Of course, I'll be right there. The correct answer is C. Of course, I'll be right there. Number 3. Where's the nearest ATM? A. Just around the corner by the bank. B. I don't have any cash. C. You need to take a left turn. The correct answer is A. Just around the corner by the bank. Number 4. Is there a vegetarian option on the menu? A. Yes, we have a veggie burger. B. The restaurant's closed. C. I prefer the chicken steak. The correct answer is A. Yes, we have a veggie burger. Number 5. How much does this book cost? A. Sure, I'll buy it. B. I love reading books. C. It's $15. The correct answer is C. 
It's $15. Number 6. How often does the bus run? A. I work from home. B. Every 30 minutes. C. I came by car. The correct answer is B. Every 30 minutes. Number 7. When is the meeting starting? A. At 3 p.m. B. I'll be ready. C. That's my favorite restaurant. The correct answer is A. At 3 p.m. Number 8. Are they planning to renovate the lobby? A. The lobby is on the first floor. B. This desk needs repairs. C. Yes, starting next month. The correct answer is C. Yes, starting next month. Number 9. How often do you travel for work? A. My job requires it. B. Every month. C. I work on weekends. The correct answer is B. Every month. Number 10. Did you receive the email about the meeting? A. It's scheduled for 2 p.m. B. No, I haven't checked my inbox yet. C. Yes, we can meet this afternoon. The correct answer is B. No, I haven't checked my inbox yet. Number 11. How do you get to the office? A. Every Monday. B. By bus. C. At 8 a.m. The correct answer is B. By bus. Number 12. Is Mary joining us for lunch? A. The restaurant is Italian. B. No, she has a meeting. C. I ate a sandwich. The correct answer is B. No, she has a meeting. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. Our flight to New York is scheduled for tomorrow. What time should we be at the airport? We need to check in by 10 a.m. Got it. I'll be there by 9.45. By what time do they need to check in? A. 10 a.m. B. 9.45 a.m. C. 8 a.m. The correct answer is A. 10 a.m. Number 2. Are you attending the training workshop next week? Yes, I've registered for it. Me too. It'll be good to learn the new software. When is the training workshop? A. Next month. B. This week. C. Next week. The correct answer is C. Next week. Number 3. I need your help with the budget report. Sure. What do you need? Can you verify the expenses for last quarter? Absolutely. I'll start on that right now. What does the man need help with? A. Verifying expenses. B. Preparing a presentation. C. Scheduling a meeting. The correct answer is A. Verifying expenses. Number 4. We're running out of office supplies. Can you order some more? Sure. What do we need? Primarily paper and ink cartridges. I'll place the order right away. What supplies do they need? A. Notebooks. B. Staplers. C. Paper and ink cartridges. The correct answer is C. Paper and ink cartridges. Number 5. Do you have any recommendations for lunch? There's a new Italian place nearby. Sounds good. Let's go there. Do we need a reservation? No, it's usually not too crowded this time of day. What type of restaurant do they plan to go to? A. Mexican. B. Chinese. C. Italian. The correct answer is C. Italian. 
Number six. Could you brief the new recruits on the project details? Sure. When do you need it done? By end of day tomorrow. No problem. I'll fit it in. When should the briefing be done? A. By end of tomorrow. B. By end of today. C. By end of the week. The correct answer is A. By end of tomorrow. Number seven. Could you review my presentation slides for tomorrow's meeting? Absolutely. I'll go over them now and give you feedback. Great. I appreciate it. What does the woman want the man to review? A. Emails. B. Documents. C. Presentation slides. The correct answer is C. Presentation slides. Number eight. Hi. I need to book a flight to Chicago for a business trip next week. Sure. When do you need to depart? I'd like to leave on Monday morning. I'll check the availability and send you the flight options. What is the purpose of the trip? A. A business trip. B. A vacation. C. A family visit. The correct answer is A. A business trip. Number nine. We need to arrange a team building activity. Any ideas? How about a cooking class? That sounds fun. I'll look into possible venues. Let's plan it for next Friday. Noted. I'll start making arrangements. When is the team building activity planned? A. Next Monday. B. Next Friday. C. This Friday. The correct answer is B. Next Friday. Number 10. Our lunch with the new clients is set for Friday. What time are we meeting them? 12 p.m. at the downtown restaurant. Got it. I'll mark my calendar. When is the lunch meeting? A. On Friday. B. On Wednesday. C. On Monday. The correct answer is A. On Friday. Number 11. Did you book your flight for the business trip next week? Yes. I got the last seat on the morning flight. Great. I'll see you at the airport at 8 a.m. then. Sounds good to me. What time will they meet at the airport? A. At 9 a.m. B. At 7 a.m. C. At 8 a.m. The correct answer is C. At 8 a.m. Number 12. The printer on our floor is not working. Let's call it to fix it. Good idea. We should also send an email to the team. I'll take care of that. Who's responsible for fixing the printer? A. The cleaning staff. B. The manager. C. The IT department. The correct answer is C. The IT department. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Join us for the farmer's market every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Fresh produce, homemade goods, and local crafts are available. It's a great way to support local farmers and artisans. Don't miss out on the special events and live music. When is the farmer's market held? A. Every Friday from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. B. Every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. C. Every Sunday from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. The correct answer is B. Every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. Number 2. We are pleased to inform you that the annual neighborhood cleanup will take place this Saturday. Volunteers should meet at the community center at 9 a.m. Remember to bring gloves and wear comfortable clothing. We look forward to making our neighborhood a cleaner place together. When should volunteers meet? A. At 9 a.m. on Saturday. B. At 10 a.m. on Sunday. C. At 11 a.m. on Saturday. The correct answer is C. At 9 a.m. on Saturday. Number 3. 
This is a public service announcement from the health department. During flu season, it is important to wash your hands frequently and avoid close contact with sick individuals. Visit your nearest clinic to get your flu shot today. Stay healthy. What is the main advice given during flu season? A. Take vitamins regularly. B. Visit the nearest clinic for a flu shot. C. Avoid public transport. The correct answer is A. Visit the nearest clinic for a flu shot. Number 4. Our spring sale starts this Friday with discounts up to 50% on selected items. Visit our store or shop online to take advantage of these special offers. The sale will last for two weeks, so don't miss out. New items will be added daily, providing great savings throughout the event. When does the spring sale start? A. Next Monday. B. Friday. C. Tomorrow. The correct answer is C. Friday. Number 5. Join us for the annual food festival this weekend at Riverside Park. The festival features gourmet foods, cooking demonstrations by famous chefs, and family-friendly activities. Don't miss the opening ceremony at 11 a.m. on Saturday. When is the opening ceremony of the food festival? A. 10 a.m. on Saturday. B. 11 a.m. on Sunday. C. 11 a.m. on Saturday. The correct answer is B. 11 a.m. on Saturday. Number 6. Thank you for using SmartBank. Your transaction has been successfully completed. If you have any issues, you can contact customer service 24-7. Please keep this receipt for your records. Have a great day. Uh what should customers keep for their records? A. The bank statement. B. The transaction receipt. C. The ATM card. The correct answer is A. The transaction receipt. Number 7. As part of our safety campaign, we urge all employees to wear their identification badges at all times. If you lose your badge, report it immediately to the security office. Remember, security is everyone's responsibility. What should employees do if they lose their identification badge? A. Ignore it. B. Wear it all times. C. Reported to the security office. The correct answer is A. Reported to the security office. Number 8. Our digital literacy workshops are designed to help you improve your computer skills. From basic internet browsing to advanced software use, we have classes for all levels. Workshops are held every Tuesday and Thursday evening. Register online to secure your spot. When are the digital literacy workshops held? A. Every Monday and Wednesday. B. Every Tuesday and Thursday evening. C. Every weekend. The correct answer is A. Every Tuesday and Thursday evening. Number 9. Our company is dedicated to reducing its carbon footprint. We encourage all employees to recycle and use energy-efficient appliances. Small actions can lead to big impacts. Let's work together to create a sustainable future. So, What are employees encouraged to do? A. Work longer hours. B. Recycle and use energy-efficient appliances. C. Take public transportation. The correct answer is C. Recycle and use energy-efficient appliances. Number 10. Welcome to the annual charity gala. Tonight's event will feature a silent auction, live music, and dinner. All proceeds will go towards funding our community outreach programs. Thank you for your support. What will the proceeds fund? A. A new building. B. Community outreach programs. C. Medical research. The correct answer is A. Community Outreach Programs
number 11. Attention shoppers, our big summer sale starts today and will continue through the weekend. Enjoy discounts up to 50% on select items across the store. Don't miss out on these incredible deals. How long will the summer sale last? A. Until the weekend. B. All month long. C. Just today. The correct answer is A. Until the weekend. Number 12. The ABC Tech Conference schedule has been updated. The keynote speech will start at 10 a.m. in the main hall. Various workshops will be conducted in the breakout rooms throughout the day. Don't forget to collect your conference packet at the registration desk. What time does the keynote speech start? A. 10 a.m. B. 11 a.m. C. 9 a.m. The correct answer is B. 10 a.m. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, he was not well, he attended the meeting. A, as, B, despite, C, because, D, although. The correct answer is D. Although. Number two. The meeting was postponed. The weather. A. In spite of. B. Despite. C. Because of. D. Because. The correct answer is C. Because of. Number three. If we. Better prepared, we would have won the contract. A. Had been. B. Have been. C. R. D. Were. The correct answer is A. Had been. Number four. We expect the delivery. Next week. A. To arrive. B. Arriving. C. Arrives. D. Will arrive. The correct answer is A. To arrive. Number 5. He left the office early. He could attend a meeting. A. Because. B. Because of. C. So that. D. So. The correct answer is C. So that. Number 6. The customer complained. The service. A. About. B. 2. C. 4. D. On. The correct answer is A. About. Number 7. The presentation. By the time the manager arrives, A. Will have been finished. B. Has finished. C. Will have finished. D. Had finished. The correct answer is A. Will have been finished. Number 8. The new policy will come into effect. Next month. A. By. B. At. C. In. D. On. The correct answer is D. On. Number 9. They were Tired to continue working late into the night. A. More. B. So. C. 2. D. Very. The correct answer is C. 2. Number 10. He suggested a break before continuing the meeting. A. To take. B. Taking. C. Takes. D. Take.
The correct answer is B. Taking. Number 11. We've been working on this project. Several months. A. In. B. During. C. For. D. Since. The correct answer is C. For. Number 12. The contract needs to get C. A. The. Before we proceed. A. Reviewed. B. To be reviewed. C. Reviewing. D. To review. The correct answer is B. To be reviewed. Next up is part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. The meeting has been rescheduled to Friday at 3 p.m. Please make the necessary D. A. Arrangements. B. Arranges. C. Arranges. D. Arrangement. The correct answer is A. Arrangements. Number 2. Attention. The parking lot will be for maintenance this weekend. Please use the alternative parking area. Thank you, facility management. A. Closing. B. Closes. C. Closed. D. Close. The correct answer is C. Closed. Number 3. Dear Mr. Johnson, thank you for your email. We are happy to confirm your order has been. You will receive your shipment within five business days. Sincerely, the sales team. A. Processing. B. Process. C. Processed. D. Processor. The correct answer is. C. Processed. Number 4. Hi Lisa. I noticed you have not yet submitted your report. Can you please? It by the end of the day? Thanks, John. A. Send. B. Sent. C. Sending. D. Sends. The correct answer is A. Send. Number 5. Thank you for purchasing our product. Your order will be shipped. Ut. You will receive a tracking number soon. A. Shorting. B. Shorten. C. Shortly. D. Short. The correct answer is C. Shortly. Number 6. Dear customers, our new product line has been and is available on our website. We invite you to check it out and offer any feedback. Best regards, marketing team. A. Launches. B. Launch. C. Launched. D. Launching. The correct answer is C. Launched. And finally, Part 7. Reading. Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Attention all employees. The next quarterly meeting will be held on Thursday, December 10th at 10 Honit M in the main conference hall. Key topics will include company performance, upcoming projects, and employee recognitions. Please be punctual. Regards, Operations Team. When is the next quarterly meeting? A. On Thursday, December 10th. B. On Monday, December 7th. C. On Friday, December 11th. The correct answer is a. On Thursday, December 10th. Number 2. Our new product line, EcoClean, is now available. EcoClean offers a range of eco-friendly cleaning products. Visit our website to learn more and place your order today. Enjoy a cleaner home and a cleaner planet with EcoClean. What is the purpose of the text? A. To provide cleaning tips. B. To promote EcoClean products. C. To announce a sale. The correct answer is B. To promote eco clean products.
Number 3. Attention all employees. The annual company retreat will take place from October 20th to 23rd. Please mark your calendars and stay tuned for more details about the schedule and location. We look forward to seeing everyone there. What is the announcement about? A. An upcoming company retreat. B. A new hiring opportunity. C. A scheduled system maintenance. The correct answer is A. An upcoming company retreat. Number 4. Dear team, our annual corporate retreat is scheduled for the next month. We will be heading to the mountains for a week of team building activities, workshops, and relaxation. Please ensure you have completed the registration form and submitted any dietary restrictions by the end of this week. Looking forward to a productive retreat. Regards, HR Department. What is the main purpose of this email? A. To inform employees about the corporate retreat. B. To announce a new project. C. To discuss financial results. The correct answer is A. To inform employees about the corporate retreat. Number 5. Attention shoppers. We are excited to announce a flash sale on electronics this weekend. Don't miss out on exclusive deals and discounts available only in store. Happy shopping! Best sales team. When is the flash sale taking place? A. This weekend. B. This Friday. C. Next month. The correct answer is A. This weekend. Number 6. Dear Subscriber. Our latest magazine issue includes an in-depth analysis of the current economic trends, interviews with industry leaders, and expert opinions on future forecasts. Don't miss this valuable edition. Subscribe now and get 50% off for the first three months. Best regards, the editorial team. What is being promoted in this text? A. A new subscription service. B. A new magazine issue. C. An industry event. The correct answer is B. A new magazine issue. Number 7. Hello team. We have scheduled a training session on the new software update for next Wednesday at 2 on Ukayan, na? GTI PM in the main conference room. Attendance is mandatory for all staff members. This session will help us enhance our efficiency with the new system. Best, IT department. What is the purpose of the training session? A. To hold a team building exercise. B. To discuss company policies. C. To train on the new software update. The correct answer is C. To train on the new software update. Number 8. Effective immediately, employees are required to wear their ID badges at all time. All news within the office premises. This measure is being implemented to enhance security and ensure that only authorized personnel have access to the building. Your cooperation is highly appreciated. Why are employees required to wear ID badges? A. To track attendance. B. To monitor productivity. C. To enhance security. The correct answer is C. To identify departments. Number 9. Dear students, the university has organized a series of workshops on career development and job searching skills. These sessions will run from November 1st to November 15th in the Career Services Center. All students are encouraged to participate and make the best use of this opportunity. For registration and details, visit the university website. Best regards, the Career Services Team. What is the announcement about? A. Career Development Workshops. B. University Sports Events. C. New Academic Courses. The correct answer is A. Career Development Workshops. Number 10. 
Please note that our customer service hotline will have extended hours during the holiday season. From December 1st to December 31st, the hotline will be available from 8 a.m. to 10 p.m. to handle increased call volumes. We are committed to providing excellent service during this busy period. What change is being implemented? A. Extended service hours. B. Product price reduction. C. New return policy. The correct answer is A. Extended service hours. Number 11. We are pleased to inform you that our annual company picnic will take place on Saturday, June 20th at Lakeside Park. There will be games, food, and fun activities for employees and their families. Please RSVP by June 10th. When is the annual company picnic scheduled? A. Saturday, June 20th. B. Friday, June 19th. C. Sunday, June 21st. The correct answer is A. Monday, June 15th. Number 12. We are excited to announce our new corporate partnership with Green Solutions. This partnership allows us to offer sustainable solutions to our clients. Together, we aim to promote environmental responsibility. What is the main idea of this announcement? A. An upcoming event. B. A new corporate partnership with Green Solutions. C. A new product release. The correct answer is B. A new corporate partnership with Green Solutions. Number 13. Attention shoppers, we are thrilled to announce that our summer sale starts this weekend. Enjoy discounts of up to 50% on selected items. Hurry in to grab the best deals. Offer valid until stocks last. Thank you for shopping with us. When does the summer sale start? A. Next weekend. B. This weekend. C. Next month. The correct answer is B. This weekend. Number 14. Hello, team. Please be advised that our quarterly meeting has been rescheduled to Friday, October 20th at 2 p.m. The venue remains the same, the main conference room. Ensure to mark your calendars accordingly. Regards, HR Department. What is the new date for the quarterly meeting? A. October 15th. B. October 20th. C. October 22nd. The correct answer is B. October 20th. Number 15. Notice of System Maintenance. Our website will undergo scheduled maintenance this Saturday from 1 a.m. to 4 a.m. During this time, some services may be temporarily unavailable. We apologize for any inconvenience caused. Thank you for your patience. It's support team. What is the possible inconvenience mentioned? A. Change in user interface. B. Permanent shutdown of the website. C. Temporary unavailability of services. The correct answer is C. Temporary unavailability of services. Number 16. Special offer. For this week only, purchase any two items from our clothing line and receive a third item of equal or lesser value for free. Visit our store or shop online at dubitexample.com. Don't miss out on this fantastic deal. Regards, sales team. What is being advertised? A. A buy two, get one free offer. B. A buy one, get one free offer. C. A clearance sale. The correct answer is A. A buy two, get one free offer. Number 17. Dear employees, please note that our office will be closed on November 25th and 26th in observance of the Thanksgiving holiday. We will resume normal operations on November 27th. Wishing you a safe and happy holiday. Regards, Management. When will the office reopen after Thanksgiving? A. November 27th. B. November 28th. C. November 25th. The correct answer is A. 
November 29th. Number 18, dear subscribers, to celebrate our 10th anniversary, we are offering a special 30% discount on all subscription renewals made this month. Don't miss this opportunity to enjoy our premium services at a reduced rate. Thank you for your continued support. Best wishes, the editorial team. What is the announcement about? A. Offering a discount for subscription renewals. B. Change in subscription terms. C. Introduction of a new service. The correct answer is A. Offering a discount for subscription renewals.